starting again at 6 p.m. Eastern, and then if we need any others, they'll they'll kick them right after that that second round gets done. Always good to have Kamal Bay back. He is in the blue, junior world champion. Previously, now he pre had to serve a, a one-year suspension. Now he's back, and. He's going to be a favorite here against Britton Holmes to make this team, but they a lot of familiarity, as I mentioned. These are training partners for Kamal Bay. He's going to try to get to his body lock. He's going to try to get to his reverse lift. He's got a lot of ways to score. It looked like single was caught. Single, her hand was caught in the singlet there. Ooh, nice, nice little drag. Yeah, nice drag attempt there from Britton Holmes. And, and Kamal, one of the flashiest. He's, he, oh, he's sure. got some just really amazing technique, some, some dynamic wrestling moves. And uh, hopefully we'll see a few on display tonight, this afternoon and tonight. Yep, Oak Park and River Forest High School in Illinois. It's where he went, spent his high school days wrestling and made the transition to full-time Greco soon after that. And he's had a lot of success, but he's trying to make that senior world team and bring home some senior level hardware. Yeah, he was close in, in 2019, um, Russell Pat Smith at the last final X we had. Austin, I believe, a, a, a three-match series. And right now we're going to see uh, Kamal Bay hit for passivity. So one for Holmes, and he's going to get his chance on top. So we'll see the parterre defense of, of Kamal Bay and see what Britton Holmes can do from the top position as he gets set. You know, one of the things about Greco is when you get to these higher levels, the guys are so good on their feet that they neutralize each other. Usually a lot of the difference comes here from the bottom parterre position, and Britton Holmes has a lock around the body. And Kamal's gonna try to make it his offense. Britain defends, and they offer two. Two red there. Yep, two red offered. And Britain's gonna go get that time. He's gonna get it, he picks up four. Kamal's gonna get the reversal. He's on top, Kamal Bay looking for a fall. Just missed, catching that reverse half and freezing Britain on his back now. Wow. 7-2, Kamal Bay. No, check that, Holmes. Holmes leading 7-2. That's. Yeah, no, they were given uh, uh, the, the initial throw they gave. Yeah, I, I understand this challenge from Spencer Manger. Yeah. I thought the first two, or uh, at least that second four, one of those could be at least, at least fewer points for Holmes or even potentially some points for Kamal Bay. And what, what's really interesting about that whole exchange is even if they were Holmes' points, Kamal was so close to getting the fall there and couldn't quite secure it. He had the half, and then he was looking reverse. Reverse half couldn't quite secure it there. He had, he had Holmes potentially in a world of trouble, but now if he's down five, it's going to be, that's a long road back in Greco. Hey, absolutely. And, and, you know, that could force him to open up and. Yeah, these guys, you know, kind of yesterday promised to be letting it fly from neutral, lots of throws, weren't able to engage. It looked like the, the familiarity aspect sort of kicked in there, but we're going to have a look at a replay, I believe, of this exchange. Um, so I think this is the, the initial throw yeah. here. And I could. And that was the second throw, and they went they four, went two. Uh, four for Holmes out of that. And the question is, does Kamal land in danger there? Uh, that's what I'm not sure. But we could. They're still looking at it. We could take another look, probably. So here we go. Yeah, that was a second one. Kamal does land uh, in danger. Yeah, I think he does. Yeah. Yeah. Four and then two catching him on his back. This is probably. This is probably thought, right. And, and just, I, I felt like a hair away from catching that reverse half, which probably would have secured the fall, but um, Britton was able to squeeze that arm through just before Kamal. And even before this is interesting, the correct throw that they gave for uh, for Holmes, I thought was, you know, could have easily seen that scored a little differently. But a lot of these sequences are, are really close. And it's almost indiscernible, some of the calls you have to make here. As they, they continue to look at this. Yeah, a real close look, because, and I'm curious exactly if they're, if they're only looking at that second sequence or, or if they are reviewing, I'm curious if they are reviewing that, the earlier sequence. We, we can't see the, the house um, video boards from where we're sitting, so. Challenges one. Challenges one. So Blue scores a two-point counter, I believe they said on that. 
Okay, so that's how they're going to score. Three two is a huge swing, and they're taking the, they're taking those four points away, and it's now just three two. Britton Holmes with the lead, but Kamal Bay breathing a sigh of relief. A great challenge by Spencer Mango, who's over in the corner there for for Kamal. Holmes stepping in there. Kamal. One of those Greco wrestlers, he actually has almost like a folk style freestyle kind of stance at times. He kind of has his hips back and then he can explode in. He has nice high dives or swim for his uh, body locks. As they're indicating for, for Kamal to kind of keep his head up, engage his hips. 35 seconds to go, two three minute periods here in all three styles here, Greco, women's and men's freestyle. What I'd be curious, and, and you know, these these matches can be nip and tuck. How exactly was everything scored? Who got a two? When did they get the two? Because um, criteria could definitely play a role here. Yep. We're headed towards the nice hard club there from Holmes. And you see a little outside step attempt there for the, the duck from Kamal as he just kind of starts jogging, trotting over to the over to the corner. Meeting with his coach, as we said, Spencer Mango, I think a 10-time world team member, wrestled in at least two Olympics. Lightweight staple. Yeah, he was an absolute beast for years for Team USA. Shout out to whoever made the Spencer and Ryan Mango highlight tape back in the day, put it on YouTube. One of the, one of the original. Yeah. There's that in Gable, Competitor Supreme. Oh yeah. And we start action Fire here up. in the second period. No paint, no change. 3-2. Britain with the lead. A pair of world-class athlete program wrestlers. Army W cap uh, out on the mat. Britain thinking arm throw. Retreats. Retracts. And Kamal takes a little bit of ground. Trying to get Britton out towards the zone as he moves, moves his way back to the center, hits a little drag, and Kamal comes to a collar tie. Kamal getting that head right in the neck, trying to drive in, have good head position. Right now, chest to chest. And continuing to kind of attack that right arm of Kamal Bay is Britton Holmes. He's reached under to look for a drag a couple times. Almost a uh, and they're indicating Faking an arm throw and blue white again, paddled, but, but they white paddled by the judge and chair, so he's not going to go under. Yeah, you would think that they're going to indicate towards red at some point as, as Kamal went down in the first, and they typically, you'd think you'd see Britain put down in the second. And I think the thing here is, and why it was white paddled, is you're not seeing enough from Britain to merit a second opportunity on top. I, I think it's pretty close to even. So it may be Kamal's turn to get a chance from the top position, but I don't know. We'll see if the whistle, uh, and I, I heard uh, action red. the chair, Sammy Julian, say action red. They want him to, he wants, Sammy, he's tapping his red paddle. He wants them to indicate towards towards Britain. So the chairman trying to, and there we go. We see it offered, and they're confirmed. And so there's one point, so 3-3. Three, three. And criteria now for Kamal Bain, he's getting a chance on top. So. He's in a dominant position right now, although he has the narrowest lead possible by criteria as he goes reverse lift. Yeah, he's you know, one of the few guys that go reverse lift, uh, at least for Team USA, most of the guys just work, work their gut wrenches as he's hopping one side then to the other. Holmes trying to give maximum resistance as he gets up to his feet with it, standing, and now what's gonna be the call yeah. here? Caution red, I think I saw a foot foul. Yeah, maybe a, it was a, a leg foul, yep. if so. Leg foul. So that's two more points for Kamal, and he's gonna get another chance on they're, top, and they're gonna throw the brick. Yeah, I, I believe I saw a foot involved in that sequence as, as Kamal tried to step over. It looked like he blocked with his leg. Of course, you cannot use your legs in Greco there, wrestling. Yeah. yeah. And was it just caught in between, or did he? Uh, yeah, we'll see it again. Yeah, we'll see it again. We'll see it backwards, and then we'll see it forwards. Yeah. Ah, uh, I mean, well, I don't know. Yeah, it looked like Kamal's foot was trapped in between. It yeah. doesn't necessarily look, at second glance, like Britain was doing that on purpose. He's not hooking. He's, He's not. He's just laying his. Yeah, it, it, it seems like the natural way is his feet would lie. It, but it's confirmed. 
To all you young Greco wrestlers out there, don't do that. Whatever it was, don't do it. And so, now Britain's gonna go back down. So two points on the board for Kamal. He's gonna... Plus one more for the failed challenge. Yep, plus so three, two on on the change, one on the lost challenge. And we're gonna go right back. Kamal goes a rear lift. Whoa. Oh my goodness, that's gonna be five. High amplitude and a fall, maybe. He's got like a north-south position here. And that's gonna do it, Kamal Bay. Wow's the crowd here to finish this one off. First match of the afternoon and some excitement. Not unexpected out of Kamal Bay, the human highlight reel. From a near, you know, down 7-2 to a dominant 10-3 win. And you can see when Kamal Bay gets his chance on top, he is absolutely dangerous. And he presents problems that very few guys in America can present. Absolutely. So he's going to 